Good morning everyone, it's Beck here from Hello My Name Is Beck, and I'm popping in to do some mail opening with you today. Um, it's not that bright outside yet so I have turned on my overhead light and you can see the reflection over here so I apologise for that. Um, I might just take out the plastic um, that you can see here um, and then we will get into, I've got three here. Um, so. Uh, so this is from Lizzie, um, so it's a heat resistant acetate that she's found, so I look forward to having a play with that and doing some embossing on the heat resistant acetate. Um, so we'll just dive into what we have here. Um, I'll just move that off a bit. Um, so this arrived yesterday, this is from Kelly Burgess, she is a happy mailer, so She's actually made this beautiful card just here um, and she's written it inside, um, I hope you enjoy this happy mail, but she's also included um, this beautiful uh, packet of sequins. Um, so I'm looking forward to being able to pop those into sequin mixes um, later, but she's the most beautiful card maker. I love um, everything that Kelly sends to me and um, yeah, she's a, a valued member of the the Happy Mailers. So let's open up what she has sent through. Okay, save that bubble wrap. Now it looks like there is tissue paper but we also have some sticky tape just here so instead of ripping the tissue paper I plan to just snip it, snip it. Oh wow. Let's put that tissue paper just there. Oh, look, you've got the little kitty in the teacups. This is stunning, Kelly. Beautiful raspberries, the teacups, create. Um, then we've got this uh, binding over here, which is um, sort of a baker's twine. Love that. Let's open this one up. Okay, so it's a photo album. Love the, um, the backing papers. Really, really gorgeous. Super cute embellishments. Love the little kitty hiding there. Then we have Life is Lovely over here. These um, cards that you can see do actually slide out, so that's very cool. We've got beautiful embellishments along here. Happy place. This um, card slides out underneath and it has journaling spaces and also the photo opportunity on the back. Really, really pretty. Love, love, love. Gorgeous, gorgeous papers and the blueberries and raspberries. That's awesome. Definitely a lovely fruit stroke summer themed mail. Really, really gorgeous papers. Thank you so much, Kelly. That is absolutely lovely. Thank you. I will um, treasure that and uh, see what photos I um, come across that I can marry up with that photo album. Um, so pop that off to the side. This one here is from Emma. She is in Tasmania um, and she is a happy mailer. Um, her address is on the back so I'm just going to um, slice across the top with my scissors um, so that I'm not showing that on camera. Oh, candies. I think they're candies. Anyway, um, so this one came in earlier this week. So Kelly's arrived yesterday and this one was earlier this week. So open it up. Oh, that's really beautiful. So it's a 
pocket letter um, and it looks like sort of Valentine's theme. You've got forever and always cherish. Beautiful girl walking away with her dress down there. So then I'll turn it over. Oh, look at those mason jars. They're cute. So yes, I was right. It says be mine. Um, jar of hearts. Really cute embellishments. So this, the... Um, sweeties or candies they are stuck down in that pocket let's slide this one out ah very cool i've seen one of these before i've made one of these um i think in one of my videos um so it looks like her letter so i'm not going to open that one up on um camera but yes i have made one of these in my videos so um, if you do ever want to follow along a tutorial, let me know and I will um, send you the link. But very, very cute. Love that as a letter. I think I made mine just as a happy mail. Oh, yep. Okay, so she's just written me a little note about the thing and... So she's written, Happy Valentine's Day, Beck. I hope you like this pocket letter. Random act of kindness made for you, Emma. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Emma. I look forward to um, seeing all, what these are about and I look forward to reading your letter. Um, that's a really, really beautiful um, random act of kindness. Thank you so much. Let's pop that off to one side. Now, this pile here is from Lizzie Hill. She sent me a mail I think last week and I opened it last weekend. Um, I only had the one mail, so I opened this to be able to read her letter, which you can see on top here, which is the back of her letter. Um, and uh, so I just wanted to show you the actual back of these envelopes. Um, but yes, um, I opened it and I had a read and, um, but she said she found these in a charity shop and instead of actually, um, using them for what they are designed, which is like little letters or journal letters to yourself, because it says the more experienced me, the me I used to be, the me, um, the me older and wiser, my future self, the more experienced me. So these are ones that she's found in a charity shop, um, but she's also written her letter to me on the, um, the other side. So love these, what a great idea. Um, she sent me a couple of dice that um, she knew I would love. So this is her uniquely creative die set, which um, is like a flower set. It's a layered flower set, so I look forward to having a play with those. Then we also have um, a bauble. Um, it's a really, really delicate bauble. She actually sent it to me on a card recent, uh, recently, maybe last year. Um, anyway, so the the card, I think I really complimented the, the die on it, so she's actually sent it to me, which I love. Thank you, Lizzie. Um, she has been doing her painting, um, but uh, I think these are sort of a, a scan of her painting. So um, this is one of her watercolours and another one of her watercolours. So very talented on really nice thick cards, so I can use them as postcards. Now... Um, Projector and um, so yeah, Projector in India sent me and Lizzie uh, a different pad each, and so when we saw that we both had a different pad, we both um, said to each other we would give each other half of the pad. So I've sent half of my pad, which hang on is this one. I've sent half of mine to Lizzie, and so she has sent half of hers to me so that we can actually um, share so <laughs> that well, I think projector actually did write that in her letter um, and last but not least I've left this down on the bottom so that you can actually see this was what it was all wrapped in this is um, 
um, decorated by Lizzie and I think so she's had this girl um, in like maybe a coloring book or a coloring sheet from um, Celine and so she's watercolored her and popped her onto um, this tissue paper it's just a uh, wrapped tissue paper and then she's got little sayings and little puffy letters and then she's used um, lots of lovely jemmies across um, so I just wanted to share that with you because I just love the way that Lizzie can actually put together um, some gorgeous collage and it just works. I don't know how she does it, but it just works. Anyway, that's a quick video from me, just a nice 10 minute round video and um, I will see you in the next one. Take care everyone, lots of love.